Okay, hello everyone. So this time we're trying to discuss an issue with Bamboo Lab uh, land only mode and uh, Orca Slicer not getting discovered um, if you are on a different VLAN. So um, if we're in the same network, then your Orca Slicer will work just fine. So let me demonstrate what the issue is. Let's open up Orca Slicer, let it load. And if we go into devices, then if you're on the same network, then your device should be showing up in here automatically. And uh, this is only an issue in LAN only mode. So right now my printer is not discoverable, but I do have a printer that's in a different VLAN. So that means uh, I'm going to need to use uh, this script called SSDP uh, in order for it to function correctly. So this has been an ongoing issue that's been opened up last week and they're going to extend on how to uh, resolve this issue. Uh, so one way to resolve this issue if you're in the same network is to use the development branch. There is a new uh, version that's been coming out and um, I'll show you the link. This is the link that they published to use the access code as long as your uh, computer is in the same network. So that will lead you up to this page and you can download the dev version and use that to connect. Um, that way uh, it will you don't have to do all these uh, workarounds. But if you are on a different VLAN like this person have mentioned, then we're having some extra work to do. So what we have to do is, uh, according to this person, we have a SSDP discovery Python script. We have to use this in order to get our printer discoverable. So let's click on the raw and then select everything, copy it, and we're going to create a new text file. It's called this SSDP, and then we want to end this file in .py, which means this is a Python script. Okay, now let's paste this in and uh, let's go to the very top. We will see that uh, we have some filling to do. So for target IP, you can leave this as is because this is your uh, computer IP and 127.0.0.1 means your current PC. If you want to make this into another PC, then please change this. And this is your printer serial number. You can find, find it under settings. And for this, the dev model. So this will have to copy verbatim. If you have a P1S, you just put in C12 instead of this long string. So we want to change this part to C12 because I have a P1S. And then th this is the friendly name. I can give this any name I, I like. So bamboo lab P1S. And then this is just a fake signal number. And then we are connecting via land only mode. And then we are um, free from any cloud accounts. As well as uh, I want to hard code my IP 192.168.30.42 this is my uh, computer IP I mean this is my printer IP and you can see that this is completely different from uh, my local IP which we can find here if you see uh, if you hear any noise though that, that's my printer <laughs> you can see that my local IP is uh, .5.16 but my printer is in this completely separate uh, LAN segmentation. That's why we need this workaround. <clears throat> so this workaround uh, basically make my printer from another VLAN discoverable. Uh, let me just close the door. And uh, the port, we can leave it blank. And this eventually just send a UDP package to the printer and you also <coughs> allow this uh, Orca Slicer to discover this printer. So you can read up on how this is done and we can save this and run the script. For me, I will have to run the fake SSDP because it contains all my um, real information as long, uh, along with my serial number. So let me change to desktop. Use Python and then follow by FAKE, press tab, it will autocomplete. And then we can press enter. Uh, yeah, let me just show you the before. Right now, my printer is not discoverable. And let's press enter. 
you can send a request with send UDP package was sent successfully now we go back to worker slicer click on the drop down we have my bamboo lab printer click on it when we're able to connect to it okay and that's connecting connected and if we can show the live stream you can see that my printer is currently printing okay and that's pretty much it, but uh, it, like I said, if your printer and your PC is on the same network, you don't have to do all these. You can go directly under the discovery. It will be showing there. If it's not showing there, then with this uh, dev branch, you are able to connect it using access code instead of using the pin code that's on the current official version, which is a improvement. But uh, for people that are currently uh, using it on a separate network then you have to do this workaround in order to get it discoverable so that's it for this tutorial hope it uh, helps you uh, get this thing working again on lab mode and I'm planning on doing more uh, videos on making this uh, fully localized um, as well as using a third-party companion app and along with Telscale to able to um, visualize our uh, camera uh, if you are outside if you're not on under your wi-fi so that one is actually pretty easy to do but i will create another video for this um, and there will be another video uh, regarding home assistant and its integration with uh, bamboo lab printers on LAN only mode uh, i'm surprised that it, after i changed to LAN only mode uh, nothing breaks so that's good to hear so yeah let's uh, see you in the next video Take care.